Good morning, everyone. Um, this is September 28th, 2020. And um, I just want to show you, you know, I've, I've just gotten up after um, hours of um, electromagnetic weapons shot at my face. And um, I haven't detoxed or anything yet. You can see like my hair is all still full of poison. Um, I'm about to get into the uh, a bath of Epsom salts and uh, baking soda, but I just want you to see how tough I am. I mean, I'm 57 years old. And, um, you know, I get shot with uh, stuff like uh, battery acid with these electrochemical weapons almost in my face and all my private places um, almost 24 hours or every waking hour, um, and I, I believe somewhat when I sleep as well, because I'm often wo woken up from a dead sleep um, by being shot at. And um, so they'll, you know, they'll create a sore, and then they'll keep shooting poison at the sore to try to make the wound bigger and to face me and, um, you know, turn me into one of their twisted zombie creatures like they are. And um, I'm going to keep resisting. Um, I just wanted you to see how tough I am. You know, I, I have all these supplements and detox remedies and um, trying to do good nutrition to keep me strong. And I use these magnets um, that, uh, I don't know if you can see, they, they're getting chipped by, uh, you know, when I'm trying to block the, the electromagnetic weapons from hitting my vulnerable areas that they actually chip away at this metal. And you can say, well, this is, you know, kind of soft shaley uh, material here, um, you know. <laughs> so you can say that, but I also have these extra powerful magnets. And these are made of like really, really tough, uh, you know, I don't know what it is, but it looks like you could make some kind of weapon out of this. And I don't know if you can see, but they're actually chipping away at this metal too with the, the same weapons that they're using on my face and other vulnerable areas. And um, so, uh, <clears throat> you know, I'm, I'm determined to survive this. Um, they're all in really bad shape down there. Um, it's really tragic because um, even though all of them volunteered to show up under my floorboards to destroy my life, um, eventually I flipped a bunch of them and now they're hostages like I am, except um, they're, they're in a lot worse shape. Um, I hear they're getting stuff like diapers because a lot of them are incompetent, or, or yeah, they're incompetent, but they're also incontinent. Um, and they get lidocaine, I hear, which is, which is a painkiller that also soothes the skin. Um, so I'm assuming that uh, the hostages, well, I, I know that they're getting shot at too, um, and the, the bad guys force them to... Uh, shoot, shoot at me by shooting at them, um, and they're all emaciated and have myriad diseases, and uh, so they can't survive the winter. Um, it's heartbreaking, but I didn't invite them here, and um, the crazies uh, don't have a lock on their door. They could walk out any time and, and seek the medical care that they so desperately need. Um, so it's a really insane situation. Um, I just wanted to... Um, in, in case that picture of me yesterday shook some of you up, um, these chemicals are um, engineered to to shrivel and, and make me look um, sickly and, and um, um, in bad health. Um, but I rally, as you can see. All right, I'm going to go jump in the shower. Um, walk safe, be free.